Welcome back, everyone, to the world's greatest county fair, Sleep Number Grandstand, and Fair 2021, powered by SMU. We missed you, and we know that you missed us last year, too. We are so glad to see all of you here in the grandstand and around the fairgrounds. And with that, let's check in on highlights around the fair, powered by SMU. Hope you enjoyed the highlights of the Clay County Fair and be sure to take them all in because it's a wonderful thing to have and we're sure glad it's back for 2021. And we're also very, very happy to have our 2021 Clay County Fair Queen and boy is she an enthusiastic, energetic young lady along with her beauty. Please give a warm welcome to Gabby Carpenter. So Gabby, we're gonna talk a little bit about Gabby Carpenter and everything, and of course you're a 2021 queen. How did you become interested in the Clay County Fair? So I've actually shown rabbits through 4-H and even open class really my whole entire life, going on about 12 years. And so with that, I always showed rabbits in the 4-H exhibits and even in the open class at the Clay County Fair. So I've been very active in that way. When it came down to running for Clay County Fair Queen, the minimum age is 16. And I remember on my 16th birthday, I got a text from my grandpa that said, you need to run for Clay County Fair Queen. And at that time, I was not only very busy with 4-H and my rabbits alone, I was also very busy in high school. And so I knew I couldn't really give 110% to that position. So then when I became a sophomore in college, my schedule really died down. I aged out of that 4-H section. And so I really needed something to do with my time as I, I don't really like the relaxing time spent with myself. I like to be constantly busy. And with that, that's where the Clay County Fair Queen really came into play was I knew that I could give all of my effort and devote a lot of time to this position to be able to be the best representation for you guys. And you have been. Tell us about uh, your summer and what you've been doing for the Clay County Fair. So my summer has actually been very, very busy. Some of the different things that I helped with really since I've been crowned is I actually went to Minnesota State Livestock Expo this year. They added a rabbit department, so I helped run that show as well as promoting the district in the open fair. Um, one thing I also did too was I helped with the 4-H meal endowment at the Main Street Markets, not only just shopping around, but made sure to get out and make, make a lot of conversation with my community. One thing I also did too was I went around to different parades and town celebrations. It was really fun getting to see all the kids riding on the float as well as seeing the different celebrations the town have and the traditions that they have and really embrace. I also was very active in some of the different 4-H events that have been going on, like the spin events. I helped with the district livestock expo, the different livestock clinics, as well as helping with other spin events around the time. You've been a busy queen. Yes. <laughs> along with the state fair uh, trip down there too. Yes. So that's very good. And uh, tell us a little bit about your family and uh, today where you're at in your college life. So my family is actually my mom, which is Melinda Brichta, goes by Mel, and then my dad, Rick Brichta. My mom actually works with Spencer Oral Surgery, and Spencer Lakes Oral Surgery, and my dad actually works with Iowa Lakes Community College. He's the marine, small engine, so more boats and watercrafts. Um, he's an excellent instructor, love the man, he's great. Big, my family's my biggest support system, and we really embrace that. We're a very close-knit family, which I absolutely love. With school, I'm at currently a sophomore in college, and I'm majoring in ag production technology and agribusiness. I am looking at transferring to a four-year after I do finish this spring at SDSU. Well, I tell you what, your parents have done very, very well. You've done well by them. We're very proud of you as our 2021 Clay County Fair of Queen, Gabby Carpenter. Gabby, thank you so very much. You're a great gal. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Gabby Carpenter. And now let's continue on. The Clay County Fair is very appreciative of our presenting sponsor, Spencer Municipal Utilities. And here is a look at some of the things they are doing in our community. 